Let me show you this neat trick that I accidentally found in Camtasia called repeat media. Hey everyone, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here from Esatino Media. And on this channel, we show you how to create profitable content. All right, so I kid you not, I was in Camtasia editing as usual, and I'm pretty much in here editing almost every day. And I did a right click on some video media and I saw this right here, repeat media. And I had never seen this before. And I was so curious. I'm like, what is this? So I pretty much just went here, click extend right. And then it extended this video while creating a stitch. So you can see right here, there's a stitch happening, but it's still one video. It made like the two videos into one. And you can see it right there as I move it. And let me just play the clip for you here. If I'm playing it, it's basically just this stock footage that I found that I thought was cool. I didn't end up using it, but let's just see what the stitch looks like. And it basically, I don't know if you saw, but it stitched it together seamlessly. So I want to create this quick video and share this with you guys because I had never seen this before. Okay, so here's what's interesting about the repeat media. Let me just delete all this. If I restart everything and I bring this down, if I right click on it, there's no repeat media. It's vanished. It's gone, right? And you're like, well, what's happening here? Here's what I found out. You need to have something else on the timeline for it to show up. So you see how I had this like image here, just like this. Then when I go to click right click, then it goes repeat media, extend to the right, and it's gonna extend it up until this point here. So you can see that it extends it to fill this gap. So let's say you have specific time slots and you need something to come in at 30 seconds, but you need this video to extend for that entire duration. This is when you would use something like that. So I just reset it here. And in order for this to work, you do need to have something else on the timeline creating that gap. It's basically essentially a gap filler and it works on video. It doesn't really work on images. So if I right click on this, it's not going to do the repeat media. It's only going to work so far on video. And if I click this, you see how I extended it even longer. Click on this, extend to the right. It's going to extend it fully. That I thought was pretty cool. That was unique to me and I had not seen this before. So I just wanted to create this quick video, just sharing this quick new feature here. I'm definitely going to keep this in mind for my more creative video editing projects. So if you like tutorials like this, you want to learn Camtasia. Like I said, I edit on Camtasia pretty much every day. I have YouTube channel management clients, which means that I edit their videos. Head down to the description below because we have a Camtasia course for you. It's 10 plus hours. It's got a ton of lectures and it was made to help you fast track your Camtasia learning. You can head down to the description as I'll have the course link for you. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.